Yeah, for sure. You know, definitely the coaches have a lot of energy, and that helps us. You know, we feed off them. But, uh, yeah, we're in a good spot energy level-wise. You know, each day we're coming out and competing. So, you know, we're all having fun. It's a good time. But, yeah, energy levels are high for sure. And what does Coach Anderson, I guess, mean to you? What, what has he done for you um, so far? Uh, you know, he means a lot. You know, every day he works with us. And, uh, you know, he's a real personal coach. You know, he cares about you a lot and, you know, wants a lot out of you. But, you know, we work hard for him because he works hard for us. And, you know, he's a great dude, you know, great guy, but also a great coach, knows a lot. So just excited to work with him, you know. What was your experience like at Louisville before you came here? Yeah, so um, I got out there last summer and then earned my way on the every special team, started on every special teams in every game, and then got carries in four games. And then, uh, you know, just thought I could have a bigger impact somewhere else. And um, knew the opening was here, and uh, you know, home state, home school. Just felt like I could have impact here, so pretty excited. How's everything here with this coaching staff, and just everything you experienced with the program compared to what it was like at, at Louisville? Um, you know, I think the I think it's just more family here, like a lot more personal. Um, you know, Louisville is great and everything. Uh, this is more, as you know, obviously a smaller town. Louisville is a big city. Um, but, you know, football-wise, it's, it's pretty similar. I think it's just here it's a little bit more personal and close-knit, so, you know, that's always a good thing. So I saw on Twitter the other day Lamar Jackson shouted you out. Yeah. Uh, how, how cool was that to see? Yeah, that's cool. You know, that's my guy. Uh, you know, it was a, a pleasure to work with him and play with him. You know, a great guy who has all the success in the world, but, you know, just the most humble guy ever, you know. Just real personal. If I ever question, you know, he'd have an answer for me. You know, a great dude, great player, but even more than that, just a great humble guy. Do you still talk to him on a fairly regular basis? Uh, I wouldn't say regular basis, but you know, he's got a lot going on. I got a lot going right. on, but you know, if I ever need anything, I know you know he's there for me. We're we're good. We're good friends. What do you have to learn the most? playing in this offense right now? Um, I think just tracks and footwork. In this offense, you know, it's kind of a slower offense. You know, we're not going to do a lot of tempo stuff. You know, we'll still have that in there. But, you know, um, just trusting the tracks, trusting what the offensive line's doing up front, you know, just running hard and keeping it downhill. Is it kind of weird already being, like, the most experienced guy in the room? Uh, you know, a little bit. Um, you know, I also got James here. He has a lot of experience. Tyler's got some experience. So I think we're, I think we got a good group of leaders. It's, it is good. You know, I need to step up and continue to be a leader vocally. You know, um, in, in my actions. But you know, it is kind of a little weird. But you know, I just got to step into it and embrace it. You've been around, you know, FBS, Power Five. But you know, we've only seen the running backs there. Does James Gilbert kind of compare pretty well to what you've seen in the past? Yeah, yeah, for sure. You know. At this level, you know, every running back can play. And, uh, you know, James is a great running back, of course. So, you know, yeah, he does compare well with them. You know, every running back can play. And I think we're, I think we complement each other well. So, he was just gonna, how similar or different are your skill sets, you and James? I think we're, we're pretty similar. You know, we can both do a lot of different things pretty well. Um, you know, frame and stature wise, we're kind of similar. So, I think we'll just complement each other pretty well. You know, we both do some good things. So, I know you came in as a walk on. Does, does it kind of stick in your head like, you're still trying to earn the scholarship? Yeah, for sure. You know, I got to continue to play the ship on my shoulder, you know, continue to want to earn that because, you know, I do feel like I deserve it. I just got to earn it and show it to these coaches and show it to my teammates. So I always have a chip on my shoulder for that reason. 